Right, so my name is Agassicles Stamus. This is my YouTube gaming channel, channel, Rounding Off Infinity. And this is yet another entry in my gaming diary, chronicling my life and times as a gamer. So tonight, uh, I'm going to put in a very short amount of time on what is arguably one of my favorite games of all time, which is Free Space 2. Um, <clears throat> love this game, and I just hope that it plays as well as I remember it. So I did do some uh, some uh, pre-recording uh, prep and um, <coughs> verified that the game does come up and that it runs and, and I've configured my joystick. So tonight I'm playing uh, on the CyberPower PC Fangbook 3. I'm actually using my SciTech X45 uh, flight control system. So uh, this is one of the few space sims where the flight model is such that uh, it really lends itself to using a standard FCS like I would use for a current day um, flight simulator instead of having to use something with the uh, with the twist stick uh, control input. So the X45 works pretty good. Um, for recording equipment, I'm using the Elgato HD60, the Logitech C720 as the webcam, and a uh, blue Yeti USB microphone. I'm all running over to my HP Slimline 410 desktop which is my streaming station uh, and I am using a pop filter with the with the Yeti tonight so uh, have a check the game so hopefully everything will go well there may be a little noise uh, on the Yeti because um, it is sitting my arm is actually going to be running right underneath it to get to my throttle oh, that drops you right in the action <laughs> Alpha 2 here. I have a visual on the convoy, 1,500 meters dead ahead. The escort wing is down two fighters. IOTA transports. This is Alpha right. wing of the 53rd so Hammerheads, GTD Aquitaine. Roll. We have orders to protect your convoy. What's your status? Oh, we're coming on the trailer. Alpha wing, we have lost three transports to the rebel attack. The surviving vessels have sustained moderate damage. We anticipate the rebels will return in greater force. Hang in there, Iota. Command will send a recovery craft as soon as possible. All right, Alpha. Let's get to work. We must defend these transports until the recovery ship arrives. Sensors picking up incoming hostiles. A wing of hurt is closing in. Alpha 1 and 2, intercept those fighters. We will engage and be on the first one. Now, I went with a stock loadout. How am I reach? Throttle stick is not what I want it to be. Let's close this guy up and try to take him with a missile. All right, we're going to down already. I'm not showing any other enemy aircraft in the area. Oh, he's coming in over here. There we go. Now I think what I have selected. I thought it was my direct fire, but that's actually a homing missile. Missed him. Yeah, that is a homing missile. Alright. Oh. Closer than I planned. Targeting for 
a split second. We have transmitted your coordinates to the GBD Samtic. The vessel should be exiting spell space momentarily. TCV Belisarius, a Dimos class corvette, has run our blockade of the Sirius jump node. We are now tracking the vessel through subspace. We have vectored its course to your immediate vicinity. Acknowledged, command. We will intercept the target. One issue is my Incoming jump signature. It's the Belisarius. Here we go. Gunnery control, power up photon beam cannons. Commence plasma core insertion. Uh, where did I put cycle secondary weapon? All units stand clear of the Samtic and Belisarius. Okay. Belisarius, this is the GVD Samtic. You are ordered to power down and surrender. Negative, but the NTF is the only legitimate authority in this system. So yeah, this game drops you right back, smack dab in the middle of a civil war. Your posturing insults us both, Basudan. I will not give up my ship. As you wish. Gunnery control, open fire. Belisarius' objective has been neutralized. Wow. What's coming next? Now deploying wing Zeta and Theta. Your EWS board, Alpha Wing. Okay. Mission accomplished, Alpha. Return to base. Well done, pilots. Alright. So it was kind of quick and easy, at least for the latter half. You are clear for docking. First bit of it was a bit rough. Good work, pilot. You held off the rebel attack and saved both Basudan transports from destruction. Your squad mates and I all agree you'll make a fine addition to the 53rd Hammerheads. Command reports that 75% of the refugees have been recovered with few casualties. The remaining 25% are under Allied protection and will be rescued shortly. We've also won major victories against the NTF. The NTD Jacobus and the NTC Hengst have been destroyed, and our blockades of the Alpha Centauri and Sirius jump nodes has isolated the rebel fleet. Furthermore, 600,000 ground troops will soon land on the surface of Cygnus Prime in our effort to retake the planet. Prepare for your next mission, pilot. The battle for Deneb is not over yet. Nice. What did I get for stats? One kill. <laughs> Hit percentage was basically horrible. Command has ordered the 53rd Hammerheads to secure an NTF depot in the Deneb asteroid belt. Six sentry guns are positioned around the depot, and rebel freighters are now moving the cargo out I think of the I remember area. This mission. The NTF has gone through a lot of trouble to hide these materials. Alpha-1, your mission is to seek and destroy all targets of opportunity, including freighters, cargo, and sentry guns. Beta Wing will scan the cargo. Recon sighted a wing of Loki's guarding the depot, so prioritize these bandits. Do not underestimate the importance of this mission, pilot. A depot raid won't win you any medals, but it can be just as vital as taking down a cruiser or corvette. We must sever rebel supply lines if we want to achieve a decisive victory. Now I'm fitted out with the Subak, Rock Eyes, and 
Tempest Missiles. Oh, that's the, the Tempest is the double fire. Yeah, so is the rock guy. Uh, well, by fire and forget, they must be, that must be the homing missile. And then after you expend all those, when you only have ten, then you can go to the dumb fire, okay. And the other option I have is this, uh, disruptor weapon, which I think what you can do is when that hits, it does things like it takes down their shields um, on larger capital ships, it'll disrupt other systems like engines and weapons. <coughs> I'm gonna go ahead and stick with the Subak for right now. Okay, Alpha Wing, let's take out the fighters and freighters. Beta will scan the cargo. Watch those sentry guns. Beta Wing, target cargo units and close in to scan. Alpha 1 and Alpha 3, you target the fighters. Stay focused on those Lokis. Not the smartest approach, Command, but... we've got a problem here. We can't scan the cargo. Run a diagnostic, okay. Beta. Are your sensors malfunctioning? Negative. There's some kind of shielding on these units. Our sensors can't penetrate. Acknowledge, Beta. Abort the scan and engage the enemy. What about a recovery app? Negative, Beta. Command will not risk recovery in that asteroid belt. Missiles just seem to not do a lot of damage until I take the shields down. I overshoot him. Now the truth is, I probably would have done better with the Logitech screen 3D. Oh, okay, okay. Definitely need to close that up. Especially before this other fighter grab my kill. Way too close when I fired that. Somewhere in here is a sweet spot on the range, and I'm not sure what it is yet. Problem is, it's reach on this joystick isn't such that it's let me Capital ships that I'm supposed to take out on this mission. And it's incoming! Where we got? There we go. Just another Loki fighter. They seem to be jumping in one at a time. We have secured the depot, Command. All bandits have been neutralized. Alpha and Beta, destroy the cargo units. Hold on, Alpha. 
Long range sensors are picking up another hostile target three kilometers from your position. I'm reading nothing here, Command. We're detecting a faint EM signature from one of the asteroids. Transmitting coordinates now. I'm still not getting a clear read. There's too much interference. There should be a flashing red blip on the radar screen of your HUD. Maneuver your fighter until this blip is centered in the radar. This will point you in the right direction. It's a large asteroid, Command. With some kind of structure built in. Let's take a closer look. Proceed with caution, pilots. I feel like I need to conserve my hard ordinance. There's gonna be something else coming in. Hat on my missile switch. Target has turrets and a fighter bay. It must be a rebel installation. We're scrambling bomber wings now. Destroy that base, pilots. Great. Delta wing now in position. Command, I'm picking up incoming hostiles. Engage and destroy those fighters. We need to clear a path for Delta wing. All right, I'm gonna stay on the. See if I can do it any damage. If I get nothing, then I'm gonna go ahead and. This is Admiral Bosch <laughs> of the Neo Terran Front. Allied what? fighters, break off your attack. Command, the rebel leader is on that base. Disregard that transmission, Alpha. Admiral Bosch is in the Polaris system. This must be a decoy. If you destroy this installation, you sign the death warrant of our race. I demand unfettered access to the Sirius Jump Node. There will be no negotiations, Bosch. Listen to me. If my safety is guaranteed, I'll withdraw my forces from the net. Pilots, destroy that installation. You have your orders. station or by the way come on come on come on come on come on let's get on Up now. 
That's not an installation. Disable the engines of that warship. Do not let them escape. There's no time, Command. The vessel is powering up its subspace drive. Bosch and his warship have jumped.
be not giving this guy at all. friendly so that they don't get in my line of fire.
running into each other. There's like five or six ships chasing this one guy. Seven to four percent. These accounts are something. supply in this game, but I have no idea what that method is. All hostile fighters have been neutralized, Command. This mission is over, Alpha. Return to base. issued no official explanation for Admiral Bosch's presence in the Deneb system. The hidden base and the shielded cargo units only compound the mystery of the Admiral's agenda. Under the circumstances, there was nothing you could have done to stop the escape of Bosch's command frigate, designated the NTF Iceni. Intelligence has also learned the Neo-Terran Front is working on a secret project known only as ETAC, possibly a weapon of mass destruction. By destroying all cargo units in the depot, we disrupted Bosch's research. I contributed in some way, destroying all those container units. Statistics probably horrible. I had nine, ki well, nine kills, a bunch of those were cargo containers. One Hercules, one Loki. Friendly hits this time from all those fighter ships that were around me chasing that last dude. Intelligence has tracked Admiral Bosch's command frigate, the NTF Iceni, through subspace. thousands auto saves and I hope it does go ahead and relaunch it just Intelligence has tracked Admiral Bosch's okay, command okay, frigate, so. the NTF. We should tell you which mission in the subspace. campaign it was, but we have vec that's fine. All right, we'll see this video sometime later. Thanks a lot. I appreciate you for giving it a view, and uh, I'll be back sometime later with some more gameplay. I think my plan for this weekend is to maybe play a little bit more of this or some uh, digital combat simulator since I got the X45 all hooked up. So, thanks a lot for checking out the video, and. Uh, Check back here for another installment of my gaming diary on the Rounding Off Infinity YouTube gaming channel. I'm out of here.